was dealt a very difficult blow. And last year when he came and got to spend time with his hero, Roger Federer, out on the court, and he got to hit some balls, I got to chat with him a little bit. H how do you teach perspective? How do you teach balance in dealing with adversity? Well, I think that's a great question. And I think you look at Mark's life here. As a young boy, he, he lost his leg. But he shows us you can do more with one leg in a positive attitude, right, than two legs in a negative attitude. See, you know, Mark didn't spend a lot of time asking, why me? But he spent a lot of time asking, how? How am I going to do this? But when you, when you ask, uh, ask about perspective, I, I think it gets back to what I said earlier. I think it's back to gratitude. Uh, I think it, it's humility uh, and hunger. You know, humility is realizing that as good as you are, you can always get a little better. You know, you look at the greats in the game, and they're always looking for ways to build their capacity. You know, they're working on new strategies, new tactics, and always trying to get better on, and I'm inspired by that. And, and, and number two, it's that hunger. It's they find a way to win. You know, I watched Novak Djokovic the other night, and, uh, you know, he fought through that very, very difficult match. He said something at the end that, that I thought was really profound. He said, it was tough, but I never stopped believing that I could win. That's amazing. There it is.